caught on camera a burglar on a crime spree in Northeast Portland. He hit a popular restaurant and wine bar, and the owner says he stole cash and wine before destroying something much more valuable than all of it. KGW's Catherine Cook has the story. Yeah, so in the shop. At pairings. To make wine more fun. Portland wine shop and bar. And approachable. Owner Jeffrey Weisler approaches wine. And less pretentious. A little differently. So if you were to describe a friend as mischievous, awkward, and unpredictable, mm -hmm. I'd give you a wine where you can taste those three words. But there's just one word he can think of to describe what happened Thursday morning. It's sad. You know, it's sad. Around 6 a.m., Jeffrey says this guy broke into his store on Northeast 24th and Gleason. He stole 150 bucks from the cash register. Isn't that ridiculous? Then made a big mess. There was glass on the floor here. There was a rock over here on the ground. The computer was totally smashed. A couple of things on the bar that made no sense at all. Like the stick of butter on the counter stuck with a wooden spoon. A friend of mine today called him the butter burglar. Next, he went downstairs. He just pulled stuff off the shelves and there's stuff all on the floor. He was clearly just rummaging for something gold and shiny. The gold and shiny turned out to be this urn punctured with a screwdriver. Jeffrey's mother passed away in March. Her ashes now spilled on the floor. I was so freaking angry. You know, I have a brother and a sister and we were going to do something with all that together and now I don't know what to do. Jeffrey says the burglar left his shop with a bottle of wine and crossed the street here to 24th and Meatballs. He figures he used that bottle of wine to break open the glass door. The guys inside say he stole a Coke and a cookie. Surveillance cameras at the restaurant capture the suspect wandering around, going through the fridge, and even losing his shoe. I don't think there's any chance he was in a regular state of mind. Jeffrey says insurance will cover most of his financial damage. As for the emotional part. I'm thinking about my mom right now. That'll take time. Yeah. In Northeast Portland, Catherine Cook, KGW News.